All right, and thus begins the tour of the Atlantic Sail. This is my cabin. Uh, you can see two twin beds, a closet, storage for life preserver and submersion suit, desk, various items, my big trunk full of books. Here we have the bathroom, sink, medicine cabinet, shower, it's a good shower, toilet, indeed, yes. All right, let's continue outside. Explore a bit of deck B. Hey, so these are the other cabins. There's more one floor below. Here's the conference room for passengers. Uh, this is a dial to show how much we are listing in bad weather. Uh, nice little entertainment area with games and music and movies. Another desk, a little pantry area, and that's pretty much the conference room. All right, we'll go to the bridge. All the way down this hall. days to figure out my way around this place, but I think I have it now. And right now we're at sea, so it's okay to just go on the bridge without asking permission. In port we would have to ask permission. There would be work going on and you don't want to distract the people. Hey, I'm giving a, a tour of the ship before I leave. Hey. Is there uh, somebody in our path? So this is the bridge. going to go from one end to the other. We're about to enter Hamburg and the Elbe River. We're kind of surrounded by vessels here. Here's another one. But on either end of the bridge you can see control panels for navigating in port. Uh, here's a compass. Pretty cool. I don't want to bother the people working right now. Cappuccino machine, very important. There's Gary and Connor. All right. hall and I missed the door here stairway. Uh, steep stairs on, on these ships so now we're on 
deck A. And you can see this is where most of the crew quarters are. Also the more passenger quarters. Um, there's lots of safety signs everywhere with various procedures for sailing and whatnot. They're pretty interesting. So there's the galley, also known as the kitchen. Here's the duty mess, mess hall. Here's where we eat three times a day. There's the schedule. We have coffee machine, refrigerator, etc. etc. This is the day room. Ah, hello. That was the captain. I don't want to interrupt his meal. Uh, all right, laundry room ho. And uh, on the walls, there's lots of these uh, blueprint maps of the ship, which are kind of interesting. All right. Laundry room, very exciting. So this is pretty uh, pretty funny. So there's lots and lots of signs in here about what not to do with washing machines and various punishments. And you will make hand washing by yourself. So also the, the captain has his own laundry machine and you better not use it. All right. Laundry room, and out of the sport room. Sport room. All right. Various exercise equipment. Uh, mm hmm Indeed. This is a room for the sauna. I haven't used the sauna. But it's in there. All right. To the outside. Gary. Say hi, Gary. Hi, Gary. <laughs> I'm giving a tour of the, of the boat before I leave so I can show my family and stuff. It's okay. Family and friends. So I've been just about everywhere going down the list here. But <laughs> we're on the, uh, on the outside deck B. We can walk around here and get some exercise, some fresh air. Go for a swim? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and uh, these big box things are fans for the ventilation. Uh, this is helium, I think, for the weather balloons. This is a crane for loading things on and off the boat. There's the bridge where we were just earlier. We can walk around the front here. And here's the front of the ship. The bow. And whoa, look at that. There's a ton of ships over there. What are they doing over there? Huh. Yeah, there's so many ships. All right, well, something's going on over there. A 
Also, uh, here's the uh, cargo containers. Um, these big walls can be raised and lowered to accommodate more containers. And the internal um, rolling storage areas can also be raised and lowered. Here's one of the lifeboats. Um, this is not the main lifeboat. That one is on the stern of the ship, and it's more like a submarine. So, we're uh, crawling up the English Channel towards, uh, we might already be through the English Channel. That appears to be a tanker. Some kind of tanker. Maybe. Here's the uh, the stack. That's the end of the ramp right there that lowers. All right, now up to the compass deck. the helipad and when we're in port we're not allowed to be up here but when we're at sea they kind of uh, let us walk around so this is another hatch to deck B here's uh, lights for illuminating the helipad what those are. This says the weather balloon. So uh, periodically they'll uh, send sensors up with these balloons to uh, give a better um, measurement of the weather. And that's the compass deck. All right. So I can go back down. to my cabin, if I can, I can't open that door, all right, never mind. All right, let's see which door is it, be this one. Here's the uh, main stairwell, the elevator, there are, I think they said 15 floors to this ship. Um, previously we went on a tour of the engine room, that was as deep as we got, but we're pretty much in the top floors right now. Alright, deck B, this is my cabin floor. Here's a sign. There's the conference room. And my cap. Alright. So this completes the tour. Hope you enjoyed it. I know I did. All right. That's it.